Hey Sag, I am ruining everybody's Christmas this year, right? Cause I am like digging in on everybody's surprise presents that are coming in uh, for Christmas from the universe. So let's see, Sag, what uh, Santa is bringing you for Christmas. Have you been naughty? Have you been nice, Sag? Or is the universe just bringing you um, some much needed um, advice? Uh, give me a sec, Sag. I'm thirsty. Hold on a minute. Mm. I'm a freak for some tea, man. All right, Sag, let's see. What you getting for Christmas? I want to know. Let's see. You got a couple flippers here, but it's a lot. So um, we just going to take them because I don't want to teach you out of your gifts, right? <clears throat> All right, so for Christmas, you're getting a gift of transcending. So you are getting some type of elevation spiritually, uh, Sag. So your awareness or there is an awakening energy that is going through you, you know, at this time. Ooh, protection. You're getting protection uh, from the uni for Christmas. And uh, what does this say? Ooh, change. So... The universe is bringing you a legit an upgrade. You know, um, I do feel like this is a spiritual, you know, upgrade. So your gifts may not be able uh, to be touched um, for you this Christmas, Sag, at least not physically, you know. But as far as your soul and your ascension and your consciousness, you are legit being given a upgrade. You know, upgrades are great, right? Because they open up all kinds of opportunities and they bring all kinds of things into our awareness and it helps us do that inner work, right? So spiritual upgrades are the bomb, okay? They are good for us, you know, and they come in, you know, all kinds of ways. You know, sometimes, you know, spiritual awakenings and upgrades can come in silently in our dreams, you know, in our meditations, or they can come in spiritually through towers, disruptions, and things like that. But still, it's a gift. It's a gift, right? So let's see what else you're being gifted with for Christmas. Meanwhile, Sag, if, you know, you have anything going on that may be feeling a little suspect in your life and you may be a little uncertain about, just know that the universe is like, really surrounding you at this time you are the first sign that has gotten uh, uh such a, a beautiful gift you know there's nothing like spiritual upgrades and ascensions right you know you're absorbing all that blue light you know that's coming in from the cosmos right now all that blue light that the sun is radiating to us is upgrading all of us you know our dna you know and things like that and so you are getting an acceleration you know uh in your consciousness right now from the divine so i like you what i see what else oh damn you got a lot of cars pop out like really okay you're gonna put me to work it's all right all right, so you got operate in honor. So the universe is gifting you this gift because they know, Sag, that you are ready, right? And that you're gonna use these ascensions, you're gonna use these spiritual gifts, you know, to elevate the consciousness of others. And while you're doing that, right, you're going to operate in the energy that a God would, right? Honor, truth, you know, authenticity and things like that, right? You have do moon rituals here. So the universe is trying to drop you a gift, you know, uh, during your, your moon cycle. So use those moons and those cycles, the full moons, the new moons, you know, all that moon stuff, you know, to help manifest, you know, and enhance the gifts that, you know, are being given to you. And it says, beware of illusion. So the universe is bringing you mad clarity, right? It's allowing you to see, you know, the cracks in the crystals of the matrix, uh, Sag. So you're give, being gifted with, you know, that that cosmic, you know, um, foresight, you know, if that's a thing. But I just feel like there is something here that, you know, is giving you a conscious spiritual elevation. And you are going to be moving mountains with that gift. So what else are you being gifted with? What else? What else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Yeah. 
Sag, I don't even know. Did I show you these cards? I'm not sure. So you got change, right? So something is changing, you know, with your consciousness here. You have protection, you know, and you had transcending. Okay, so if I didn't show you, I just did. So there we go, right? Look at all of that cosmic light and beauty that is shining on you right now. You know, let's see what this change is. Let's see if we can get some more messages. I know this is a conscious change. This is a spiritual change. Like, you know, definitely some type of, you know, elevation here. So what other gifts for Sag? Oh, come on. All right, one more time and I'm gonna pluck a Sag. So let's see. These big cars, they all thick and stuff. They don't fly out as easily. Ooh, we got a flipper. So we got action. So you're being gifted with uh, some type of movement here. Of course, like I said, like there, there is an energy here of some type of elevation. And we're going to read that card in just a second, Sag. Because we want to get into these gifts. You know, we want to get into every single drop of what it is that uh santa's bringing you in and putting under your tree this year Ooh, so you guys get a wish yeah you get a wish for christmas very nice and you get a key right this is this is like more wishes this is like good stuff Ooh, let's read these okay let's see all right so let's start with this action card that we got here so this card card says now is the time to perfect i'm sorry now is the perfect time to act okay all right Hmm. Yeah, very nice. Okay, so now is the perfect time to act. Take inspired action towards your dreams. Move forward with confidence. So some of you know that this upgrade, you know, is happening to you, right? You know that the universe is staring you like in a new direction. So with key here, um, it says new beginnings, right? Yeah, something is opening up, like something that's being ignited and started in you, Sag, that is going to change the way you view the world, right? You know, you're not going to be stuck in, you know, these illusions, you know, anymore. You know, the universe is opening up um, a wish. You know, I think for some of you, you may have been asking like, hey, you know, what is this? You know, what is this I'm living in? Like, you know, what is this world? What, who am I? You know, and you've been asking for these downloads. You've been asking for this clarity, you know, and awareness, Sag, and it is dropping in your stocking for Christmas. So key, new beginnings, directions, and adventures await for those ready to let go of the past. So yes, so you are moving forward, right? You are you know, eager to figure out what is inside of you, like what is driving you? What is that force that is, you know, in that avatar, right? You know, like what is, what am I? What am I doing? And the universe is like, oh, you want to know? You know, here is your wish, right? Here's your wish. Here's the key to some of those doors that may not uh, have been uh, available to you or seen by you in the past. And this wish says your heart desire is ready to come true. So sad. Like what kind of voodoo is you doing, you know, right now? Because the universe is responding, you know, to your request to kind of seek knowledge of like that, that esoteric stuff, like the unknown, like, ooh. All right, go you go magician, go. Four of Pentacles, so, right? You know, the Four of Pentacles has an energy of like, you know, holding on or possession, right? And the Four of Pentacles, like I feel for you, you know, the universe is allowing you, you know, to possess some of those secrets, right? Some of those things that, like I said, once before, maybe, you know, you did not see, you know, I feel like you're operating like in that high priestess energy right now. Like the universe is like, oh, you want to see? You know, I'm going to show you. And it's opening up your awareness. So you got the Knight of Pentacles here. So, you know, you guys, you know, it, we're in a place where, you know, um, you probably felt like, you know, I'm stuck. I'm grounded. You know, like, again, like, you know, you know, you, you know that you're, you know, in this 3D space. But at the same time, you know that there is something else out there that you want to know about and you've been making slow and steady progress towards you know learning you know 
um, and new things, you know, studying things that maybe you've never studied before, you know, reading some of those weird books, you know, about aliens and astronauts and consciousness and time and space and different theories, right? I mean, for some of you, you're like little, you know, little, what is it? What is his name? Isaac Newton? The hell is his name? Anyway, you know, you guys are like running around, like observing your world and the universe is opening up, you know, and removing that veil so you can see clearly what's going on. You know, you're going to be like a little shaman, you know, for Christmas. Nice. Slow, steady progress. So, ooh, seven of cups, right? Yes, opportunities. Like, there are things that for some of you with the seven of cups that you've been dreaming about. You've been seeing things in your dreams, right? You've been, you know, I don't, you've just been in a state of awe, you know, to some extent. The seven of cups is all about illusions. And I mentioned that you know, earlier, right? Beware of illusions, you know? So, you know, you know, the universe is trying to prepare you, uh, Sag, for something. You got, you know, a, an energy here that where you may have been stuck in an illusion because it says beware of illusions. And then you have the seven of cups, which is all about <laughs> illusions, you know? And you are getting the gift of revelation, you know, a gift of transcendence. You know, a gift of, you know, change, you know, in your consciousness, Sag. So we're going to get you one more card to see what else you're getting for Christmas other than the spiritual upgrade. That's what's under the tree for you this year, Sag. But let's see what else, what other gift there may be for you. So we have the Nine of Wands, okay? So this right here is the ending of suffering. You know, the Nine of Wands, you know, it can be a lot of mental, you know, um, anguish and a lot of, like I said, not knowing who you are, where you're going, you know, what is all of this that's going on, you know? So the universe is saying, hey, you know, I'm gonna make this a little clearer to you. So for you, the universe, again, is opening up a world beyond worlds, you know, physically, uh, consciously, uh, in your environment, in your mind, just, it's just, it's, it's, there's an expansive type of energy here, but not one that you can physically touch, Sag. It almost feels like this is all out into the cosmos, all in the mind, you know, all in the soul, you know, so to speak. So no worries, right? No worries, right? You know, um, you're going to get the truth that you are seeking, Sag. So for Christmas, Sag, you're getting a gift of elevation and um, awareness from the universe. So I hope you like your Christmas gift, Sag. Like and subscribe and happy holidays to you.